13th round with your main man, Kenny Caraway. Shout out to the dope ones. Big ups to Jordan Brand, always showing love. And big ups to Cola Seamoss. Fine apple, pineapple today. And uh, go to colaseamoss.com. Go get you some of that good stuff. Shout out to my girl, Cola, man, doing what she does. Canelo Alvarez went home to Mexico to take on John Ryder. And he was looking for, you know, that big, dramatic knockout. Looked like he might have had it in the fifth round, but it wasn't to be. John Ryder got up, and Canelo had to accept the unanimous de decision victory, um, beating John Ryder in a predictable fight. I guess you could say that. It was predictable. I mean, I didn't. I didn't, I didn't think John Ryder was going to um, was going to serve much of a, a formidable opponent for Canelo. I had Canelo getting him out of there in the fifth round. Like I said, he knocked him down in that fifth round. But you know what John Ryder did in that fifth round? He made a he made a decision. He said, "I can leave out of here with my payday and be good, or I can fight." And he decided to fight Canelo Alvarez. And he got some good looks in, man. He got he had some good combinations. He, he did some good things in that ring. I don't think he ever really hurt Canelo. Canelo was getting hit a lot, mainly in my opinion, because he knew Ryder couldn't hurt him, so he wasn't really focused on the defensive end. And, you know, he, he, he took some licks because of that. But at the end of the day, Canelo with an easy 12-round unanimous decision victory. And I was talking to Jesse about this. I don't know where Canelo goes from here. Obviously, everybody wants him to fight David Benavidez. I don't think he's ever going to fight him. I continue to say that. He seems to be stuck on this Dimitri Vival situation. Nobody really wants to see that fight at all. And I'm making a prediction right now. In about in 18 months, we're going to see Canelo walk away from the game. I mean, his skills are declining a little bit. That doesn't mean he's no good. He's still one of the top fighters in the world. But they're declining a little bit. They're really... What what else does he have to prove? What else is out there for him? Obviously, like I said, Benavidez, want to see that. I'd like to see him against one of the Charlos. But I don't think he's taking either one of them fights, even though he said they're on his radar. I think in 18 months, Canelo retires. He's fought for a long, long time. And I think the end is near. We'll see. That's the 13th round.